Well, the prison closure affecting uh, work for people in and around Raymondville. Now there's some renewed optimism that the, the change uh, could improve things. Channel 5's Kristen Von Pricing has a story. Located down the road from the vacant prison in Willacy County. It's one of those hole in the wall restaurants. Everybody has to eat. <laughs> Known for the burrito loco. Cowboys merchandise. Owner Diana Castillo says the lunchtime crowd slowed down when the prison closed. The tips went down drastically. Castillo and 11 employees felt the impact. Her sales were nearly cut in half, but Grandma's kitchen stayed open. They never left me. They they suffered, but they never left me. It didn't just affect the people here. People around Raymondville were suffering. Castillo's grandson. Then he got laid off, so he was out of a job for a while, for months. He had to find work in another valley city. There are signs of hope, the news of the prison. Yes, I'm excited. And then we're gonna have the windmills coming also. It may bring more customers in for lunch. After all, everybody has to eat. In Raymondville, Christian Mom Pricing, Channel 5 News at 6.